Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, I and the caretaker of the orphan will be in paradise together like this, raising, by way of illustration, his forefinger and middle finger jointly, leaving no space in between. Dar al-Iman Orphanage is located in PWD Housing Society, Islamabad, near the expressway. This orphanage has been established since 2010. Alhamdulillah, Dar al-Iman Orphanage provides orphans with a homely and warm family-type environment in a home of high standard, comfort, and hygiene. The main purpose of our setup in Pakistan and our foundation is to help orphan children get an education. So we, alhamdulillah, have been working very hard for nearly a decade now, providing education, a home for orphan children that come from very poor backgrounds. From grassroots level, we are giving them uh, English medium education. And also they're having an Islamic ethos where they are learning their Islamic studies. Good quality education and skills that will enable them to become productive, responsible citizens, and most importantly, upright Muslims, inshallah. You take them to a good private school. When we mention to them they are coming from an orphanage or a hostel, the proprietors, directors or principals are hesitant and reluctant to take on these orphans. Because of the stereotype image of orphans, they are coming from poor, uh, deprived backgrounds and they will have lack of mannerism and morals and etiquettes. We're trying to change this type of mentality and alhamdulillah we've proven that over the years. Its educational institute is set up to enrich the orphan children with strong Islamic moral values good quality education, and skills that will enable them to become productive, responsible citizens, and most importantly, upright Muslims, inshallah. To give these children a chance in life, a good education is essential, and more so, the correct understanding of Islam and its beautiful values. My father died because of cancer. So my brother brought me to Dar Liman. Alhamdulillah, it's a very good place. Uh, I've got the opportunity to live here uh, because of good standard education and worldly and religious as well. I'm studying Quran and I have uh, memorized five paras. I, I can speak different languages, English, Urdu, very well. Alhamdulillah, I'm progressing here. We hope to provide opportunities for higher education so the children are able to stand on their own two feet. We encourage them to further their Islamic studies and we also encourage them to get their professional studies so inshallah they can be a service to society and the Muslim Ummah. This orphanage is trying to instill Islamic tarbiya in an interesting and loving way. So the children will grow to love Islam and will acknowledge the Prophet, peace be upon him, as their role model and the Quran as their book of guidance, inshallah. Mera naam Abdul Aziz Ahmed. Main class four mein padta hai. Har cheez achhi hoti hai. Har cheez routine se milti hai. Hum hume har din saaf sutre kapde milte hain. Har din naate hain. Jute har din polish hue milte hain. The method of teaching has given the students hands-on experience which makes them independent in problem-solving and boosts their confidence level. My name is Muhammad Nabi. I want to become a doctor because in the village there is no good doctor. So I want to become a doctor there. Inshallah, these children of today will become a beneficial asset to the Ummah of tomorrow. The base of Islamic education is Qur'an and Sunnah upon the understanding of the pious predecessors. 
This provides a complete way of life to the Muslims and following the teachings of Islam is the real way of success. Alhamdulillah, Dar al Iman has professional Islamic teachers to teach these orphans Tajweed and Hifzul Quran. हम बच्चों को दिन रात मेहनत कोशिश लगन से पढ़ाते हैं और अल्हम्दुलिल्लाह बच्चे भी इसका अच्छा रिस्पांस देते हैं और अच्छा पढ़ते हैं माशाल्लाह यहां तजवीद हिफ्स और नाजरे की क्लासेस होती हैं इसके साथ तौहीद और बाकी दीनी علوم के साथ-साथ अरबी बोलचाल सिखाई जाती है दालमान हैज गिवन द चिल्ड्रन अपॉर्चुनिटी टू बी व्हाट दे वांट टू बी but we have emphasized that Islam is a priority with them. They must pray five times a day. They must understand what Islam is really about. We hope that these children will progress to become educated and a service to society. Meanwhile, whilst the children prepare to offer salah, the chef prepares a very hygienic lunch for them. They sit with discipline in the dining hall where they are served and eat according to the sunnah. We have a, a setup where we will have a personal carer with them 24 hours a day in, in, the, in the home. These children obviously then have a personal relationship with all the staff. It's very difficult not to become personally attached to these children. And then the children, alhamdulillah, they, they appreciate that and they, um, they enjoy the environment that they're living in. It is noteworthy that this little safe haven offers them sports facilities, which is vital for a healthy life. Dar al Iman has a playing area where they play football and other sports every day. <laughs> Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, The best house among the Muslims is the house in which orphans are well treated. Dar al Iman Orphanage assures that it strives in efforts to provide a high standard of care for the orphan children. Dar al Iman Orphanage has state of the art hostel facilities for orphan children residing here. The children live in well equipped hostel complex in a very neat and hygienic environment. Each room is completely self-contained with its own heating and cooling system, fully functioning kitchen facilities, dining hall, study, and prayer rooms. It is too tough to be poor. You cannot do whatever you want. To. If you are poor, you cannot go to a good education school, you cannot read, you cannot do whatever you want. Alhamdulillah that I am right now here. Inshallah, I appeal to the people to help us, aid us financially, and inshallah, we ask Allah to accept it from us and from them. Looking after an orphan is a great deed that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his messenger, Muhammad, peace be upon him, emphasized. Your sadaqah and zakah donations can make the difference to the life of an orphan child. Support us with your sadaqah jariya and zakah. Let us help those that are orphaned and in need. Let them prosper with your gift, inshallah. Together, through your contribution, we can help make for those in need a bright future and honorable life, inshallah. Allah, Allah, Allah.